Hey guys, it's Di from Be Mommy with Style, and I did my first plan with me last week. You guys seemed to enjoy that, so I thought I'd share with you what I'm planning on doing this week. I'm gonna try to keep it short and sweet and simple, but this is my Erin Condren planner, and I'm going to be using this this week. I just got this cute little clip from How Cute For You. It's the unicorn, so I have that in there this week. I've got all my washi tape laid out. I'm using my Stedler pens, and I've got my stickers. But this week is Natalie's first week of preschool so what I'm planning on doing is actually having a Rapunzel theme this week there is my one from last week and I thought Rapunzel would be perfect because Natalie loves Rapunzel so I'm gonna be doing a little bit of a Rapunzel decoration and I need to just write things in but you can see I already have here Natalie's first day of school she's going on Tuesdays and Thursdays and we may opt into some Fridays as well and then my mom is also visiting here this week and then Bella of course has school so I'm gonna start getting everything out and show you the stickers I'm gonna use also in the dollar section they started getting the Halloween things in and I found these super cute to-do notes so here's what I basically do because I write things in as we go through the week and so I like to you know write a lot of things so I want to leave some extra space for that I also like having a to-do list over here at the side but then I make a daily to-do list so I either use the note paper that I showed in a haul or like little sticky notes like these for my daily to-do list so I really like these for Halloween so I'll probably be using these for most of the month of October but I just find it handiest for a daily to-do list so I can check things off and kind of take it with me if I want and that is what works well for me. So this week's design should hopefully be pretty quick and easy because I actually have these sheets from My Little Angels Creations and they come with a number of just themed Rapunzel stickers. So I'm gonna be using these. I also have these two pink princess, they're kind of like lavender for Rapunzel. Princess washi tapes, I'm gonna be using those for accents. I'm gonna have my sticker stickers, laundry stickers, I'm gonna to try to use those, or some sweet treat stickers this week. And I also really love these Sweet Kawaii Designs to-do list. And then of course my sticker patch, little weather stickers, I love those, it's just a nice at the glance weather. And if I can fit them in, I have these lanterns from Vintage Gypsy Road, and lanterns of course with Rapunzel go perfect. So I'm gonna start laying everything out and start writing in some additional things for the week and get going. So along the top, I just used this thin washi that has a little bit of a dot pattern on it. I don't honestly remember where it's from, but I, leave it, I believe it's from Michael's. And I'm just running that across the top because I like filling in that blank space up there. I'm gonna be using some of the inserts from my Rapunzel sheet from My Little Angels Creations. And on Friday, for whatever reason, I like decorating the boxes on Friday, I put one of the little Rapunzel sun design inserts there. Then down here along the bottom, I just used this Princess washi that I believe I got at Joann's Fabrics. And I like blocking off this bottom area just to kind of separate it out from the rest of the schedule. So I ran that along the bottom. I'm gonna take the purple laundry sticker and I'm gonna put that on there for a reminder for Saturday. I'm kind of trying out some different things with our schedule. So I've been trying doing our laundry on the weekend. Sometimes I do it over the week, but I'm just gonna put that as a reminder to do everything that's left over on that day. I also put one of the grocery shopping stickers up there on Sunday as a reminder. And then for the weekend, I'm just gonna use some of these lantern stickers. I'm gonna use them for decoration over here for the weekend. I just used another insert from My Little Angels Creations and then one of the flag designs over here for a to-do list. And this is from Sweet Kawaii Design. And I'm gonna use this cute little Pascal sticker over here by my to-do list. I'm gonna use one of the Rapunzel's on Thursday because that's a day that Natalie goes to school. And then I'm going to put the tower sticker on Tuesday, which is her first day of school. And I'm gonna put one of my favorite phrases on that day too. Then using my phone, I just look at the forecast and I kind of look at the estimated forecast. And again, this is not like gospel forecast because I'm getting it off of my phone. So like last week we had quite a bit of like chances of rain whenever I did my book on Sunday and then it ended up being a really nice clear sunny week. So hopefully this forecast is right though because it says it's supposed to be sunny most of the week and pretty warm and then we only have chance of storms towards the end of the week so that's a pretty good forecast. I'm going to be using green for my meal plan to uh, do a throwback for Pascal. And this is the meal plan along the bottom. To be honest, it'll be a little bit in flux this week just because 
my mom and stepdad are here visiting, so things are always kind of flexible when they eat out some nights. So I built one night in because usually people like to eat out like the night before they leave at least. And then I also left some days flexible here, so that'll be ever changing, but I'm pretty flexible with my meal plan. But our meals of the week are planned out. Crockpot chicken, taco salad, Italian beef, possibly one dinner out, pork carnitas, and then there's some optional days here as well. Other than that, my schedule is gonna just be written in, but I do wanna write myself a reminder the painters are supposed to be here towards the end of the week, either Thursday or Friday. So I'm just gonna be writing in a reminder here. And then I should know middle of the week and I'll write more information. But for right now, I'm just gonna leave it like this. And here's my to-do list that I can actually take out and take with me. And I can add to this as the week goes. My longer term to do, I'll put over here. I can also write myself some notes down here. And then I usually write in notes as the day goes on, or like for notes that need to go back, or if they need to bring things to school with them and that sort of thing, appointments that come up. So this is my layout for the week. It is Rapunzel for Natalie's first week of preschool. And thanks so much for watching. Have a great day.